<clears throat> okay, the directions say find the x and y intercepts and graph the line. But I'm actually going to have you guys do a little bit more than that with this. I want you to have a few things that you're going to use as a checkoff list. You're going to tell me the coordinate pair. for the x x or the x intercept and the y intercept you're going to tell me what slope equals i will leave the sticky note up as we start working um, your goal is also to tell me what the equation is in slope intercept form This is for each of these problems, there's going to be a total of six things that you have to do. So coordinate pair for x-intercept, coordinate pair for y-intercept, slope, finding the slope-intercept form equation. We're going to graph the line. And finally, you're going to tell me the slope for its perpendicular equation or perpendicular line. And we're going to do that all together right now on number two. So it's all right there. Don't stress. I'm going to leave this up here so you can get this down. Let's do number two together. What form are these equations in? Take a look at them. Standard. They're in standard form. And what form do we need to get them into? Slope intercept form. We want to graph the line. We want to find the x and y um, intercept. Thank you. I lost the word for a second. And we want to find the slope. So when I look at this first one here, I'm thinking if I put a 0 in for x, what would 2 times x be? Zero. So I'm going to use what I call my cover-up method, and I'm just going to cover that up thinking that 0 is now x. What is my y? 2. Zero. So here is my ordered pair, 0, comma, two because I put a zero in for X and I got a two for Y if I put a zero in for the Y that leaves me with 2x equals 2 how do I get the X by itself divide by, divide by 2 so what is my X then equal one. one comma zero that's when I put in a zero for the Y that means that this is my y-intercept and this is my x-intercept. So it's a negative slope? It is a negative slope, isn't it? Mm -hmm. One of my checkoff lists is to graph the line. I've got two points. Can I graph the line with two points? Yes. yes. Could I use that line to find the slope? Yes. But I already have to turn this into slope-intercept form because that's one of our tasks. So I'm going to take 2x plus y equals 2. How do I turn that into slope-intercept form? I want to isolate the y by getting the 2x term on the other side, which means I'm going to subtract it. I'm going to rewrite this then as y is equal to negative 2x plus 2. Does that check out with stuff we already know? Yes. Is my slope negative? Yes. Now that I look at it, does it look like it's rise up 2, run over 1? Yes. And is my y-intercept 2? Yes. So it feels like I got the correct equation. My slope is negative 2. What would the slope of my perpendicular line be? We're going to put opposite reciprocal of the M would be positive one half. This is negative, so it's going to be positive. This was two over an invisible one, so its reciprocal is one over two. Who feels like they could do some practice on this? Most of it is practice. The new piece of it is opposite reciprocal true yeah. okay if you look on the cover there's four problems here 
I will warn you, number four, the x-intercept ends up off the graph to the right a little bit. Look at it right now. If I put in a zero for the y, I'm going to get x is equal to what? Mm. And that's going to end up about here. Just do your best to guess. Every, uh, all the rest of them, because I did this myself yesterday, all the rest of them fall somewhere on the graph. That's the only one that's off of it a little bit. Okay. Open it up and look at how many are on the inside. So there's four on the cover. That means a total of 16 problems. That's a good amount of practice. We have six minutes left. Your six period classmates received this yesterday. They have not done this, the perpendicular parallel reciprocal piece of this, but they worked on this in class yesterday because we did testing and you guys didn't have me. I'm gonna say this is due Friday. Does that seem fair? Yes. Okay. How do you find